Charisma of Charisma's Corner and we are in the Little Pink Barn. I am so excited to bring this project to you today. It is called Pink Pumpkins. Pink Pumpkin Quilt actually, sorry. It is a free pattern by Poppy Cotton Fabrics and they are girls of my own heart because they also love everything pink. So if you've never been to Poppy Cotton's site, you should go to their site because they have the sweetest lines of fabric, I kid you not. In fact, all of these pumpkins are scraps of some of their lines. So pink, pink is their jam, right? So um, I just had to jump in on this train because this quilt looks so perfect in my studio. <laughs> And I just wanted to share this simple tutorial on how to make this block. And so what they're asking is that um, you can use scraps or um, they have laid out the yardage. So 13 assorted pink fat quarters, one brown fat quarter for the stems, four and a fourth yards of background fabric, and then five eighths of a yard for binding and five yards of backing. And the quilt makes the size 67 and a half by 74 and a half. And each of these blocks are, um, they finish at six by six. So they should be six and a half by six and a half. Um, and so there, the layout is there, how to make the blocks are there. You have a fun little um, checkered kind of sash. So you can use all of those scraps. So you see those on the side there. So cute, so fun, perfect for October, Breast Cancer Awareness Month as well. And so let me just jump in and show you how to make this block, okay? So I have one done here in aqua because, you know, pink and aqua go so well together. And um, I was just kind of practicing and wanted to use my uh, stash of poppy cotton fabrics. So these are the ones that I pulled out. I had a lot to choose from, but I just pulled out this bag because I saw the cute little pink mushrooms. So, um, okay, so we need our square or rectangle that is five and a half by six and a half. You need your stem, you need your two background pieces on the side of your stem and then you need four one and a half inch squares that are stitch and flip for your pumpkin these uh, background okay so let's see the stem is a one and a half inch square and then these background ones are one and a half by three so two one and a half by three one and a half by one and a half stem four one and a half by one and a half backgrounds and five and a half by six and a half for your focus fabric. Okay. So we got all that and I've marked the lines on my stitch and flip squares here. So we can just put those in the corner and we will sew directly on that line. And we're just going to do that on all four corners. that we have all four of those corners stitched, we're gonna go ahead and cut those. Okay, and that part is finished. And now we just need to sew our stem in between our two background pieces here. towards my stem so that's pressing to the dark and then I'm just going to go ahead and sew this on top of my pumpkin body here okay and there is our pumpkin so I will leave links in the description box for a link to the pattern it's a free pattern that you can just download from Poppy Cotton Fabrics. 
and I'll leave a link to their site so you can see all their beautiful lines. And of course, I'll be sharing my blocks on Instagram and I think they have a hashtag for that. Well, I would use the hashtag Poppy Cotton Fabrics. Um, you can tag them and I would do the pink pumpkin quilt. So hashtag pink pumpkin quilt and tag Poppy Cotton Fabrics. And please share the love if you want to share this video. Please like and share. And um, I hope that you have a beautiful Halloween or holiday fall season. <laughs> okay. Be blessed. Bye.